All right, Math 8 students. So this next con uh, is called comparing irrational numbers with a calculator. So you can see I've already pulled up the calculator just to kind of teach you how to type it in. So you need to figure out what this number is. So first for the negative, you just click this button right here, the negative button, and that will give you this right here. Then you hit the square root button, which is this button. When you press that button, this will appear on your calculator along with the first parenthesis. Then you simply type in this number 84, so you type in 84, and then you put in the back parenthesis, which by the way is right there, and then you hit your equals button. This is what you get, 9.165. So here would be 9.1, this would be about 9.09, .09. this would be about 9.16, so probably this one right here. And this one here would be about 9.21. So letter N is the only one that would have a 9.1 something answer. So that is our best approximation. All right, let's do another one. Sometimes we have to compare. So again, we have to take the square root of 0 0.45. So again, you hit the square root button. And that will give you the square root in the first parenthesis. Then you type in 0 0.45 and then hit your back parenthesis, hit equals. This one equals about 0.67, this one is 0 0.229, 0 0.67 is bigger, so we just simply say that this one is larger. And then finally the third type, you gotta put these in order to least to greatest. First of all, you all know what 4.2 repeating is, so I don't need to figure that out, but I do need to figure these two out, so the square root of 19, the square root of 19 equals 4.358, so that's definitely bigger than 4.2 repeating. And then the cube root of 64, you need to just play around with it. So you need something to the third power that will equal 64. So I eventually found out that 4, when I took 4 to the third power, it equaled 64. So I know that the answer to that is just 4. And 4, by the way, is smaller than 4.22. So I'm going to put that one on the left side. So this ends up being our final answer. That's all there is to it. Good luck. Bye-bye.